Hey, what's going on, YouTube people? Uh, I'm coming to you guys again with another video about Ashley. I'm an ambassador with Ashley Furniture, and uh, I did a couple of videos about the onboarding process and um, and then about the uh, travel itinerary, what to expect, the ins and out. You know, nothing real detail, but it is detail. Uh, I just basically sharing my experience since I uh, came on board and uh, today I'm going to talk to you guys about a few things after you uh, completed the orientation and you know had your travel and got back home to your DC and everything so we're going to talk a little bit about that but before I do I would encourage you guys if you haven't already to uh, hit the like button comment button or subscribe button or the uh, notification bell thing you know again this is all uh, new to me but you know I enjoy what I'm doing and, and I'm just gonna have some fun with this here so y'all want to rock with me you know kind of follow me again I'm gonna give you the uh, the ins and out of the uh, Ashley distribution uh, job as a driver y'all gotta get forgive me because i'm you know new to this here so again i'm not gonna uh restart this thing oh because this is about the fifth one and i'm not about to do it again all right so anyway i just want to talk to you guys again about some of the things that are going on over here in ashton what i know so far and again i'm just sharing with y'all my experience up to this point uh it's been a very uh uh well you know i've had a great experience um you know everything not gonna always be the way you want it so you know just got to prepare your mind for that but i am going to just share with you guys and hoping for those of you who are you know looking to make a change uh for as uh, another place to work at you know i feel like you're being treated well or you know just going through some ins and out freight not there uh well actually they they keeping you rolling over here they keeping me busy anyway i can't speak for everybody but i can speak for myself uh, you know, I just make sure I do what I'm supposed to do and you know, update all the uh, information I need to and the uh, people in that and uh, on the app and, um, and if I have an issue, I'll call, which I very rarely make a phone call unless I'm calling about, you know, what my, um, if I got anything coming up uh, on a low wise that I haven't gotten, you know, once I make it to the uh, shipboard or receiver well, or whether I'm unloading and I'm haven't gotten anything over the people net then i'll give them a call kind of just you know just in case because they'd be pretty busy so you know i know i'm not the only one but so you just want to make sure that you just stay on top of your p's and q's all right so again we're going to talk about uh oh yeah that referral pay ashley they don't do sign-on bonuses and i kind of understand why once you start working with them uh, but they do re do referral for the drivers, ambassadors. So I'm like, okay, well, you know what? I enjoy this. I really do. I like the place. Um, and so I might as well just say, you know, see if I can make a little money on, you know, uh, to help push things along. And then I'm just, you know, sharing my experience. And there may be some guy, because when I got ready to come on board, I was looking for videos. I really didn't find a lot of videos about Ashley drivers and you know just what was going on what they thoughts were and stuff like that beside the ones that they had on their website so um and then I did look at the reviews on Indeed you know stuff like that and uh, just kind of you know before I you know made my decision and, and I had looked at a couple of other companies Walmart Central Freight uh, uh, Cardinal Logistics Risinger uh, and those are just the name of few and like I said in the video earlier that, you know, uh, Ashley, they, they respond fast, you know, um, they really did. And once they did that, it was like, I was with working within a week's time and I needed to be working. You guys be honest with you. I don't, I mean, I just couldn't afford to have no two or three weeks just being around. I, I just, I don't know. Maybe you can do it. I can't, I need to be working, you know what I'm saying? And, um, and like I, if you go back and, and, and look at my other videos, then, you know, it'll tell you, you know, what, what happened, the reason why I chose to come to Ashton, you know, because I was an owner operator and had some things to happen, you know, uh, with the truck and and uh, the guy I was working with, uh, it was just getting tough. He just really just couldn't, he couldn't carry it. And um, I had exhausted my little resources. And so, you know, we just, we just both agreed that, you know, it would be the best thing to do. I enjoyed working for the guy, uh, it was Parson Trucking, and we had a real good run, about a year, you know, um, it was just, it was good, I, I have nothing bad to say about the, the guy and his business, he pretty much did everything that he said he was going to do for me, 
Uh, he kept his word and always tried to do the best he can to help me in any situation that I was in. So that's why I stayed with him, uh, you know, all the way until he just he just couldn't go any further. And um, but he called me. We keep in touch, you know, just for the sake of just, you know, just having good connection, good friends and stuff like that. So. So, but anyway, I'll talk about that a little later. But today I want to talk about the referral thing. And like I was telling you guys, I will um, basically share or spit my referral with whomever come on board. And again, I want you to, you know, really look at the video, listen to what I have to say. If you want to comment, add a comment. If you got a question, ask a question. I'll be checking and I'll be responding. That's what I do when I get ready to take my 10 hour break. If I got waiting on the load, you know, I just try to be creative and try to come up with some things uh, to do as well as, uh, uh, you know, just laying around. I'm not one for just laying around unless I'm just tired and I really need to just get some sleep. Uh, so I'm like, you know, hey, let me just make good use of this time like I always have. And so I do a lot of reading, uh, video uh, listening to books and stuff because reading, <laughs> I mean, I used to read, but once I started, you know, driving and stuff like that, I just like listening to it because you can drive and listen to audio book all day. So I basically just kind of get into that a lot. But on the referral thing is that uh, once you, uh, if you decide to come on over to Ashley Furniture as a driver, and we call it, they call you, we call you an ambassador over here. And you know who an ambassador is, right? And an ambassador, like you can be the ambassador to the United States or the ambassador to the UN and stuff like that. That means you represent something. So we're representing Ashley Furniture. And you know, that, that's that's pretty good. That's a pretty good title. You know, we professional drivers, and so I'm a professional ambassador at Ashley Furniture. And uh, again, I be might sound kind of cheesy, y'all, but and they're not paying me to do this other than the referral thing, uh, because I'm just sharing my own personal experience. You know, and I don't mind do that, doing that. Whether you guys come on board or not, and whether you call me or not, or whether you get my name or not, that's up to you, really. I, I really, you know, I do care. Because again, that was only you could benefit and I could benefit because they don't offer sign on bonuses. I wish they did, uh, but they didn't. And I understood that, knew that going in. Uh, <clears throat> so, you know, on the back end, though, we can all win. So if you see or you, you don't want to come over and again, we talk and uh, collaborate through the whole process. I like meeting new people. So, hey, just hit me up. And we'll communicate with you. I'll communicate with you through the whole process from the orientation to the to wherever DC you're gonna be out of to when you get on the road, you need some help or whatever the case may be. Look, I'll be there for you, man. I, I really don't mind. I, I really want to help drivers, you know. I feel like I'm at that point now in my life where I wanna really just kind of give back. And I never really wanted to be um a mentor or a trainee, but I think now I do. I really do. I wanna I feel like I have the patience for it now. Uh, I have the experience for it now, and um, and I want to be able to make my contribution to the trucking industry because it's changing. It's changing a lot, you know, and it's going to, you know, you get a lot more young people in the, in in the field, and that's good. I mean, you know, these are people who out here are making an honest living, so I support that. I really do support that. Anybody trying to make an honest living, I support that. I don't, I don't, you know. You know, like to be riding drivers when they out here, you know, learning. It's frustrating sometimes when you're waiting to bag up. And it, it happened to me today. <laughs> this guy was bagging. I'm like, man, put that thing in that hole. Let's go, baby. You know what I'm saying? But I had, you know, slow spirit talk. Look, you need to be patient. And I was patient by the long as I could. And then once I saw the open, you know, I just kind of eased on past, you know, because, you know, like I said, I understand you got to learn. And you only learn by doing. So, you know, I'm not the kind of guy that's going to get out there and just start custom. I help you out any way I can. So with the referral thing, if you decide to come on board, you know, uh, you, you have a friend, someone that you already know working and doing this. I'm working every day and, uh, and uh, you know, I'm getting firsthand experience on what's going on. Everybody going to have a different experience, but hopefully you will have a good experience. So uh, the referral is just an incentive for you and it's an incentive for me. So I will share that with whomever come on board and use my uh, employee number. It is one nine six one two seven. My name is Timothy 
Chisholm. That's C H I S M. Uh, if you're watching this YouTube channel, you can email me. You can comment. Whatever you want to do, we can link up so that way I will work with you through the process alongside with the awesome people that you're going to be working with uh, in orientation and, and on the onboarding process. I mean, you know, they they just some good people, man. They're going to make the process good for you. And, uh, you know, that's just their job. And like every other company, you know, once you get on board and everything, there's always going to be some cracks that people are going to fall through. That's just going to be that. So don't allow that to, you know, people, they, they come on board and, you know, everything don't go exactly the way they want it to go. And, you know, and they just get all up in the, in the uproar, you know, and just like, you know, and I hate to see that because you shouldn't just judge it just by one or two incidents. So, um, damn, phone call.